So y'all deviants back and doing another video on Godzilla, King of the Monsters. And in this topic, I wanted to discuss the human element of the film, which I am currently having some reservations toward. Not in a negative way, but I just don't really feel that there's going to be a strong push in the human element. Story-wise, I think it'll cover that you know, weakness with the human delivery. Because most of the time with the human characters in Godzilla movies, the execution is a little, a little, a little weak, excuse me, a little weaker than to be expected. Especially with the 2014 film when you had um, Brian Cranston doing, uh, what was his name? Brody. He was one of the Brodies. Ford was the son. I forget the father's name. Anyway, this is my setup. I hope you guys like it. It's um, homies figures from the 25 cent machine back in the day. I used to collect these and they work very well with Godzilla figures. If you go back to my um, other video, you would see that I covered how Godzilla uh, companies, what, what Godzilla figures, they don't really release the human characters. But there's improvise. You can make improvisations, if that's even a word. You can improvise on it and just, you know, try to find little miniature figurines that work well with your Godzilla figures like I've done. And if you notice, I have my Godzilla NECA 2014 um, monster figure set up here. This is the 24-inch figure that I reviewed in my last video. And I also reviewed this rock figure from the Fast and Furious line. And <laughs> this setup is kind of random, but you see like Matt Hardy right there from WWE. Um, he's seeing focus. There he is. Yeah. Uh, he got this hobo here drinking. And just all this randomness. I just like randomness. That's one of my major strengths. <laughs> so, um, yeah, as far as King of the Monsters go... I have a feeling I'm not really gonna like um, Bobby Brown, Millie Brown's character. I think there's too much focus on her, and she's just a child. Like, how much can she? Um, how come? How much can she be pushed in a movie like that, in such a grand scale? How how much importance will she hold? You know what I mean? Like, she's just a child. Like, she shouldn't really be the main focus. Um, and I think another character I'm not really gonna enjoy is the one with the glasses, the one that always has these. Little smirky statements, you know. I don't think I'm gonna like that guy <laughs> for some reason. Um, Kyle Chandler, I'm familiar with him from previous films. Uh, I think King Kong, he was in King Kong, he's done an, a, a few other films. I'm not too crazy about him as an actor, but I think he'll make a good addition to the film. Um, Vera Far Farmega, I think her name is, she's gonna play a good role too. I'm a little reserved with um, Ken Watanabe. I didn't like his role in 2014. I thought it was, he was just there. You know, it was like, oh, just put this guy there, you know, just to represent the, the culture. of. And I think that was a good point, but they could have made it a little stronger, his delivery. Um, and uh, who else? I, I like, what I like about these movies, these disaster movies, mainly are the random um civilians that get caught in the situation and they don't really put much focus in into them i want to see a extended scene of civilians just getting you know demolished by the monster action i want to see them like in the 2014 film there's brief moments where you see them you know caught in buildings but they don't really there's no like there's no focus on that it's just like a brief little clip and then it just moves on to the monster action or to the soldiers that are like far away and they don't have really much um they're not in the impact zone as much as the civilians are but um i'm just going on in tangents but yeah just this this is pretty much a cool setup here that i if you guys can see all the details um homies i recommend you collect these homie figures if you want like human characters with your godzilla figures they play a uh, very um, interesting role in, in figures as far as human characters go. Um, and that's pretty much my video. So check out my older ones. If you like this video, you can like, subscribe, 
I'm going to have more content coming up soon, um, especially with the uh, Godzilla King of the Monsters coming out. I want to do a review on that because I don't have any movie reviews. That'll probably be my first movie review because I'm really looking forward to it. I'm going to see it on March. Th um, March. We're in May, thank God. May 31st. And I'm going to let you guys know what I thought. And stay tuned.